প্রেতু আলু মে মিংলাশে ডেলি ইংলিশ এ পামি ছানে গানে পিও পালে চুজু বাড়ি ঠিকনি মা ছানে গানে পৌমিয়া সালা তুলে বিগু তেঙা জানি টেনসাপি তো মা ফে পাড়ি আসলে মিশা মা চমারুয়ে ছানেলি গো সাবস্ক্রাইলে পিলো পেগে বউন ভিডিও আতে নাই নাইমো বিনা লুটি খাওলে গুলে নি খেপি বউসে হোক চেজু টেমারি কেটা সো তেঙা জালে গো খুবই সালাই মা A special girl. To Jada Kamali. Jocelyn, I have selected you to take part in the storytelling contest. It will be held next month, said Miss Menon, our English teacher. Jocelyn, now we will be able to get out of the way. We will be able to get out of the way. Tomorrow, we will be able to get out of the way. I, I, before she could complete the sentence, Miss Menon added, It's okay. I have full confidence in you. Chama, Chama, Tuma, what's up? So much I think I'm away. Meet me, Nunga, Tapiori. Shawari, Mingunga, Yoji, Mupi, Washi. From that day onwards, she practiced very hard for the contest. Tony, I'll be to my heart. On the day of the contest, each contestant told their story confidently. When they narrated their stories, the words came out as naturally as leaves to a tree. Suddenly, Jocelyn was not sure of herself anymore. She wanted to withdraw, but it was too late. Jocelyn Tay Primary 6C, the loudspeaker blared out her name. She walked up to the stage. She was painfully conscious of herself. She stood there and looked down at the sea of faces. She cleared her throat and began, Good afternoon, principal, teachers in. She began well. However, those were the only words she spoke without a stutter. The rest of her words tumbled over each other. She continued with the story. Slowly, with every word she spoke, the giggles subsided. With every sentence completed, the whispers stopped. Finally, Jocelyn completed her story. The judges took quite a while to decide the winners. The winners in each category were announced. Jocelyn clapped and cheered the winners too. After the last winner was announced, one of the judges walked up to the microphone. 
Amidst some mummers and whispers, the judge said, I have a special announcement. Jocelyn Tay is a courageous girl. Despite her stutter, she tried her best to tell an interesting story. The judges have decided to award her a special prize just for being brave. Jocelyn could not believe her ears. She was visibly touched. With tears in her eyes, she walked up the stage to receive her prize. ทุจาตอกามาลีโจสเลนงาเบงโกปုံပြောပြိုင်ပွဲမှာဝင်ပြိုင်မှုရွေးထားတယ်နောက်လောက်မှာကျင်းပါလိမ့်မယ်ကျ
She walked up to the stage. She was painfully conscious of herself. She stood there and looked down at the sea of faces. She cleared her throat and began, Good afternoon, principal, teachers in. She began well. However, those were the only words she spoke without a stutter. The rest of her words tumbled over each other. She continued with the story. Slowly, with every word she spoke, the giggles subsided. With every sentence completed, the whispers stopped. Finally, Jocelyn completed her story. The judges took quite a while to decide the winners. The winners in each category were announced. Jocelyn clapped and cheered the winners too. After the last winner was announced, one of the judges walked up to the microphone. Amidst some mummers and whispers, the judge said, I have a special announcement. Jocelyn Tay is a courageous girl. Despite her stutter, she tried her best to tell an interesting story. The judges have decided to award her a special prize, just for being brave. Jocelyn could not believe her ears. She was visibly touched. With tears in her eyes, she walked up the stage to receive her prize. ရဲ့ချက်နယ်ကနေ့ဒီနေ့တင်ဆက်ပေးခဲ့တဲ့သင်ခန်းစာလေးကိုပြိတ်တတ်တို့အားလုံးချိုင်းနေတာကြာမေ